Hey guys, it is coming up on summer and every year we take our favorite pants and we cut them. We cut them into shorts because we need the perfect length for us and it's really difficult, quite impossible to find shorts at the length that we want. So we're taking our favorite pants and we're gonna show you how we cut them into shorts. We wanna tell you guys the process. So normally, we, have, we buy a pair of pants and we wear it like crazy for two years. And then we cut them <laughs> into shorts and then we buy another pair of pants. So then we have a pair of pants and then our shorts then will last us another two, two years. years. So then we usually have our jeans for a good four years. Yeah, and it doesn't seem wasteful when you cut them. Like at first I was like, oh, I don't wanna cut these expensive pants. But if you buy a nice pair of pants, they'll last you long enough to wear them as pants and as shorts. Yeah, but today's not the case. <laughs> We're feeling wild. We're gonna cut our new pants. These are our brand new pants over on our bollybrand.com website. Mm -hmm. We decided that we loved the high-waisted pants so much and we loved the bow. They are cropped, so you could wear them throughout the summer, but I kind of wanted to cut them into shorts. Yeah, we, we both need a pair of white shorts and instead of going out and buying other shorts that may not be perfect. We're gonna take our perfect pants and we're gonna make them into the perfect shorts. I'm so excited. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so we didn't talk about this very clearly. There's two ways we can do this. And Ellie, you want yours more distressed, right? I would like it, but I've never cut them more distressed. Okay, and I always do mine distressed, so this is what we're gonna do. I'm gonna roll my bottom and have no distressing so they're a little more of a clean look, and I think you should cut yours at the bottom, not roll it, and so every time you wash it, they'll just get more frayed, so it'll add to the distressed look. That's the game plan, let's roll with it. Okay, stand up. Okay, so I want mine rolled and I want it to hit here, so you're right, I would mark it down here. So where do you want yours to hit on your I would knee? say like right here. Okay, so I'm just gonna cut it. Just a hair lower. Yep. Perfect. About there. Yeah, that'll be good. Okay, cool. When cutting our pants, we're never that particular and and careful with it. Just lay your pants out, make sure they are pretty even, and then you can just get to cutting. I make sure that there's no folds or creases in the pant at the top, and then I come down and you make sure that the bottom pant leg is lined up with each other, and that there's no creases in it at least, and then you find your cut mark. Wonder, that's good advice. I'm just going to follow the line and we'll cut them. We're just gonna cut both pant legs at the same time, and we're gonna cut right to our pencil mark. I have the worst scissors, so Oh, I'm see, wait. I thought I was giving you the better ones. That's okay, I thought they were good. And when I go in to the inner leg, I hate when the inner leg is shorter because that's yep. the bigger part of, well, at least my leg. And I, so I kind of cut downward. You can see, you can use those scissors. I cut just a little bit at an angle. You can always cut it off if you don't like it, but I don't like when the shorts come up into your thigh. I would much mm -hmm. rather them come down. So I cut them. I love that advice because it rides up with you walking. Mm -hmm. That's yep. normal. Yep. Mine are essentially done. All I'm gonna do, I'll roll them up when I put them on. And Ellie's, I think we need to decide where you yes. want your distressing. I think it's really cute if there's something up on the pocket. I do too. I've never done this. So I kind of, maybe you can show me how. Okay. Um, and I, I try doing where it's like the ripped part. Like I like the way it looks when it's ripped, but I'm just not very good at it. So I will literally just like open it and do a baby cut like this. I love this so much. Yeah, and you can do them as little or as big as you want, like that. And when you wash them, it's going to um, fray. fray. Yep, yeah, just like yeah. that. Some people have said to take sandpaper to it too. Really? If you want to take sandpaper. But you can already see that it like frays. Bonnie, mm -hmm. this is fun. I would do kind of a longer one up yes. above the knee. Okay, let's just do it. I hope I don't ruin your pants. You won't. If you... not, I'll buy some more bollybrand.com. <laughs> just... We know where to get more. I wish I had it's seen already that already cute. This is we'll wonderful. go throw them in the dryer before we put them on. And rough them up. And rough them up, yeah. Do you want it bigger than that, do you think? No, that's great. Okay. And 
one right here. Yeah. It's it's honestly pretty simple, and you can do more than one. Like if you want to do one just like above this and to the side of it just a little bit. But I do think it looks aesthetically pleasing to have like one high, one low, one in the middle like that. Yeah. Oh, this is fun. Especially when these down here are super frayed, frayed they're gonna oh. look really cute. Like look, you can even just like take your finger. Mm-hmm. This is wonderful. And what I've seen people do is they'll oh um do the butt. Yeah, on Let's the do the butt. On the back pocket, you can do definitely one like across the pocket, especially where there's like nothing behind it. So that'll get kind of frayed right there. And then just up on the top part of the pocket, just cut off that little seam so that your pocket frays. Yes. <laughs> this is so cool. Yeah. Yeah, that's going to be can really even do cute. do like one right here. Yes. Down at the bottom of the pocket. Yes. <laughs> I feel weird like cutting up your I shorts. I love this so much. <laughs> I've never done it this way, so this is fun to see how Bonnie does it. Yeah. Usually what I'll do and is I I'll like that that wasn't just a straight line. Like she just kind of like, yeah, that's awesome. Okay, should we go throw them in the dryer and like rough them up a little? Yeah. I bet to rough them up, you could even just take your scissors too. And just kind of like rough it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, look how much that frays. Mm -hmm. Usually, I and this probably isn't the safest thing to do, but we, I put them on me and I then I cut into my, my distress marks so I can kind of see where I want them more. It's a little more difficult when it's laying down. Or you could put them on, mark where you want it, take them off and cut them. This is awesome. Good. We may have got a little bronzer on our pants I from know. our makeup video earlier. So Bonnie's just adding just a little more distress while I'm wearing these. And the scissor point is very long. When we were a child, I was I was four years old and I remember I was wearing overalls, jean overalls. And Bonnie, my dad had his drill. A power tool. A power tool. That could have been bad. And I put it right on her butt and zzz, and it grabbed her overalls, and ripped a hole, a hole in, in it, bun. and you couldn't, could you feel it on oh, your butt? No, no, like oh, no, no, it was good, but it was, that was really dumb. That was really, really dumb. What was I thinking? But I remember it happened, and we were, I think we laughed. I think I remember <laughs> us being like, oh my gosh! That like, was so funny. Oh. But like really rude, and I don't know why you did it. We've always kind of been crazy Wild. together. Okay, this is so worth it and it may not look like i cut them because of the color of my pant but oh are you just gonna do one roll or do okay you do two? however you want let's do two so it's like rolled okay so we will do two rolls a half roll and then i always kind of do a long roll a long roll at the top my legs are so dry and hairy let's just pretend that that is not what they look like well, it's nice that the camera <laughs> can't see it i hope not no that's that looks cute. so good yeah see, see you really do have to go a lot longer than you think if you want them you can always go shorter you can never add length to it so just be aware so here are two different shorts that you can wear that you can make out of your pants Thank you guys so much for watching how we take our jeans into two different types of styles of shorts. You can check out bollybrand.com for these pants and also we filmed this makeup look today. So that will be in the video previously. We'll have that link in our description as well. And we'll see you guys in our next video. Bye, Bye guys. guys.